What's going on? Fruit smoothie made by yours truly. Coconut milk, cashew milk, strawberries, blueberries, blackberries, and some collagen powder. It's good. <clears throat> So, guys, I've been MIA forever. We've been um, doing projects outside, which I know I've mentioned a hundred times now, but that is what we've been doing. And I will start um, filming it and showing you guys because we're working on the shed right now. And it's gonna be really pretty. So maybe I'll make a video and show you guys what I put in my smoothie and how I make it. I've noticed that if I use the cashew milk, which this is, was really surprising to me, the cashew milk, um, which is just from a carton, um, seems to make the smoothie more thick than when I use coconut milk. So I don't use coconut milk from a box um, or from a carton. When I use coconut milk, I actually use um, the coconut, like the thicker cream that comes in a can, and I get the unsweetened. So I always thought that that would make the, sorry about that window. I always thought that that would make the smoothie thicker, um, but it doesn't. I found that the coconut, or I'm sorry, the cashew milk actually does. But anyway, yeah, maybe I'll make a video for you guys with the smoothie and what's in it and um, how I make it. Because it's pretty good. I don't put any greens in it. I have a really hard time digesting raw greens. So I, don't, I just can't do that. And I don't put protein powder in it because I don't tolerate protein powder either. So anyway, I'm on my way to Old Bean's house. If you've not ever been here before, Old Bean is my friend. Today is her birthday. She works with me. And we live in the same town. Um, I'm a huge fan of birthdays. Tell me if you guys are like this too. I'm a huge fan of birthdays. Okay? There's like one day a year, which is sad because I feel like you should be able to do this every day of the year and not get hate for it. But it's so the one day of year where you can like celebrate yourself and not be considered a snob or not be considered self-centered or maybe people still think you're self-centered um i am one of those people that loves a birthday week a birthday month i mean i don't really do anything for a birthday month but um i don't see why there's any any shame in celebrating yourself look i'm my own biggest fan i tell people that all the time if you don't love yourself no one else is going to love you either. And if no one else does love you, you might, you might, um, then, then all you need is love from yourself. So anyway, I'm a huge fan. I'm a huge fan of self-love. I'm a huge fan of celebrating yourself. Um, and so then when it's other people's birthday, I have a huge, I'm a huge fan of celebrating them. Like, I want people to know that, you know, when it's your birthday, there's people on this planet that celebrate you, that celebrate the fact that you're here. So anyway, I'm a huge fan of birthdays, and I'm going to go to Old Bean's house today. Um, she's also known as Wilson because we never show her, so you only ever hear her in the background. Um, if you've ever seen the, the sitcom Tool Time. Wait, Tool Time was his TV show. What was the name of the show? Home Improvement. That's what it was. Home Improvement. He had a neighbor um, who you could never see his face over the fence. And his name was Wilson. Anyway, if I have to explain that to you, you might be too young to be on watching my channel. So, I 
I'm Denise. I'm Denise, in case you've never been here before. I'm glad you're here, and I think we should hang out and be friends. And if you have been here before, and you already know that we're friends, and you like to hang out, thanks for coming back. And you know I love you. We're just out here having a happy time. I don't know what Bean wants to do for her birthday, so... Does anybody's guess what we're going to be up to today? Oh, oh, oh! New joke, new joke. Where does a bee go to the bathroom? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Um, BP station. Ah ha ha! That's funny. BP stations here in Colorado. I don't think so. As far as as far as I can recall, I don't I don't think I ever see a BP station. They're like green and yellow, right? We have them back in Pennsylvania. Shout out to all of my Pennsylvania peeps. It's really pretty out today. I'll have to show you guys around because like the, the aspens are getting their little buds their little leaves and it's really nice I love all the green green so I snuck well I shouldn't say I snuck um well, yeah I snuck into Bean's house and decorated it for her for her birthday when she wasn't home so that she would be sur surprised with it when she came home. So I'll have to show you guys that. But, okay, so I have a question. This is kind of like off topic, but really there are no topics, so. I feel like every time I'm filming, I'm eating. That'll, uh, that'll clue you in as to why my uh, donkey is so large. She is not underfed, okay? So, I, I need some new bath towels. I need some new bath towels, and I, the ones that I used to really love, they don't make anymore. They're just from Target. They were a Fieldcrest brand, and they were the thickest, fluffiest bath towels ever. Perfect. And they don't make them anymore. Like, they tried to sneak in um, an updated version, and it it's terrible. It's way thinner and doesn't hold up as well. It's not as soft and plush. <clears throat> um, after you wash it, like, it's just, I'm not happy about it. And I just hate spending a bunch of money on towels and then they're crap. But anyway, so if you guys have towels that are super fluffy and worth the money please let me know put it down in the comments below because I need I need some towels I need some towels and I want them to be nice all right I'm at Bean's house that's her jeep dressed in my Sunday best even though it's not Sunday and we're gonna go celebrate her birthday you know what? Here's to hoping that you have somebody in your life that celebrates your birthday to the extreme. Okay. I need for my kitchen. <laughs> <laughs> Friends, this is the Beans birthday decorations. Do 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 do. What? Don't do that. Do 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 do. Who? I mean, come on now. I liked it. Bean's a fan of color, so I just figured I would... It's funny, because Carly and I were talking about that, and she goes, well, she really put a lot of color in your birthday decorations. <laughs> Thanks, um, Bean. You're welcome, Bean. It's a festive event. All right, that's all. It is a festive event. Oh. All right, ready? Beanage. 
I have a headache. And then maybe on the way home, we'll drive by Homestead. Yeah, we can go. Oh, yeah, we can go wherever you want, Bean. Is that annoying you? What the fudge sickles is going on? My coffee is dripping everywhere. Should you Listen. take the lid off? Or do you have another thing in here to put it in? No. I just don't understand. We really need to invent that. Because you know who would use it? Everybody. Sarah. Well, I mean, but it could go, it oh, could like be you tested want to do out. commercial. Oh, yeah. I want to be, I want to invent it and then McDonald's, be rich. McDonald's, everybody. No, I don't want it, McDonald's to use it. Oh. I'm going to be selective. Just the human being? Exclusive to the human being? Well, to start out with, yeah. Wait, right, how do we do that? Oh Mary Jane's a patent lawyer. Let's get the patent through her. Shut your pie hole. No. Well, it's a complete setup. I mean, we've got everything we need right in front of us. We've got the patent lawyer. We've got the product distributor, or the per at least the, the place that can um, I'll test the product. I'll distribute. I'm will just the, bra the brains will the company it. Will the company spring for a Rubicon for me? Jacked up Rubicon? Oh, yes. The company vehicle is going to be... So what's our what's the name? Beans lids or beans cups or? Well, I don't know that we can name it beans because we got because of the human bean coffee. So I don't want to be like stealing. <clears throat> Friends out there, don't be don't stealing our idea. Don't spill the beans. We're not telling. Don't spill your beans. The beans. Wow. Bean, we're gonna make a million dollars yet. We are gonna make a million dollars on our first sale. Do we need to bring in an engineer like Brandon to make it? Since we don't know Yeah, how I mean to make we it. have to come up with a design. <laughs> we have to outsource it. <laughs> we, have, yeah. we have to outsource the technical work. Yeah. Do we need to know the... we're gonna get rich? Do we need to start this from the beginning? No, they're no, because we can't tell them the idea or they'll steal it. Oh, did they hear? I don't think so. Um Yeah, because we want young kids in sweatshops making our product. Oh yeah. Gotta keep it cheap for you guys. Foreigners. <laughs> We're doing it. We're doing it all for you. Underpaying the, the, the children the children in a third world country. 10 cents a month <laughs> just to bring our product to you. Maybe we even go so far to say we'll double what they're making. <gasps> that would be nice of us. Bring them in. We'll give you. Did you just go bring them in? 20 cents a month. <laughs> yeah. We can afford that. Okay, so now we have to work on the design. Wait, wait, is there a joke? Yes, I saw the other side. I did too. I already told the people. What did the beaver say to the tree? I didn't see the oh! <laughs> Nice eating you. <laughs> I'm glad the beaver didn't say anything to the stick. No, 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 no. <laughs> Take. <laughs> Take two. Beaver jokes. Dogs can hear that. What did you just? What did you say? I can't believe there's a beaver joke. I know. There. That's just too easy. And I hate when they're really long because I don't have time to see the answer. I know. I know. Guys, what did the beaver say to the tree? I think it's nice eating you. It's been nice eating you. <laughs> I don't like that answer. I don't like that answer at all. Well, at least the beaver didn't say anything to the bush. Then we're just in a whole world of hurt right there. <laughs> oh, that hurts my stomach. You're working on your core. Yeah, I am. Alright, friends. We are um, looking for beans. Um, still looking for a new house for the bean. So we're going to look at some... We're looking for land to build the dreams. The bean's dream home. Yeah. 
gonna build Maybe. all your dreams. People, would you want to live back in here? Wait till they see the view, though. I, I know. Well, I mean, they already want to live in here. Am I They're like. To turn bean? Baby buggy bumpers. Wait. One day my mama said to me, Chubby, can you smile between those chubby little cheeks? And I said, Show sure. <laughs> Are you making this up as you go? Is this, are you getting this on camera? No, I am. But didn't you do that when you were a kid? No. Hmm. That's unfortunate. Is there I think funny? we did rubber baby buggy bumpers. Okay. Like with your face? Mm -hmm. Squish it more though. Okay, like this? Yeah, there you go. What is it? Rubber baby. Rubber baby buggy bumpers. Rubber baby bu Rubber what? <laughs> rubber baby buggy bumpers. Rubber baby buggy bumpers. Yeah. Okay, so now what? That's it. Is that supposed That's to all we had. That hurts. Is it supposed to be funny? It's funny is my mom said, Chubby, can you smile between his <laughs> legs? Or whatever. What you said, Chubby, can you smile between the my mama said to me, Chubby, can you smile between those legs? No, Chubby, can you smile between those chubby little cheeks? Same thing. <laughs> <laughs> Bean, I want to build over there. Up there. Okay? No, you can't be. You want to be okay. on a lake or a pond or a little river. And not the little creek that was by that little tiny house that you could throw a rock at 24 and hit. This is so pretty no. out here. Cervix. Isn't it? <sighs> yeah, but it's pretty everywhere. Not really. Yes, it is. Mm. So, okay. It's pretty everywhere. Some places are prettier. Will you give me that? It's your birthday. So that's I'll what you do. You dig a little you hole in a hillside and stick a house. Yeah. Another to the left. Then what keeps the dirt? Oh, that's ugly dump back there. What keeps the dirt from falling on you when it hails or we have a deluge? Answer me that, Smarty Pants. Hmm? Hmm? You got nothing to give. You're feisty today. 